we've been testing out EE's new 4G network to see how well it performs and we've got very, very impressive um, speeds back in London. We thought we'd bring it to one of the other 11 cities that had signal from launch, Manchester, to see if how it does here. As you can see, the 4G handset outperforms the older 3G model and records an impressive download rate of around 9 megabits per second. But we've also seen it perform much better than this, getting download rates of around 20 and sometimes even 30 megabits per second in some areas outdoors. Once we had moved indoors, we actually lost the 4G signal as it failed to penetrate the building and we had to rely on the HSDPA for the test. This produced a much lower rate of around 1 megabit per second. This would still be fast enough to browse the web fairly easily, but it won't be much use for streaming high definition films. Outdoors in London, the 4G handset performed very well, recording speeds of around 18 megabits per second. This is extremely fast and a lot better than many home broadband connections. It'll be fast enough to stream movies and download apps and music very quickly. When we went indoors, this dropped off quite a bit, while we were still able to get download speeds of around 6 to 8 megabits per second, which should be more than fast enough for most things you'll do with your mobile phone. The connection was a little unstable and our speed test failed a couple of times. For more information about 4G, click on the link below or let us know what you think of these speeds in the comments.